Afternoon, Chris from Motorcycle Reclamation here. Right, this is my Ducati 860 GTS. It's going up for sale, it's a project, fairly obviously. If it was up and running, they are five figures, they're huge money. It needs a birthday. So, it's got a little crack on the mudguard, which is annoying. The discs have actually got hardly any lip on them, though that will clean as easy as anything, just get them blasted. Most importantly, it's missing the back cylinder. It's on the floor. Now, if you turn it, I'm not going to do any more than that. Oop, it turns over. All right. I don't know what's happening in the bottom end, but it feels totally smooth and happy. I'm not going to warranty anything because I'm not stupid. Here we have a new head to go on it. Now, this is either new old stock or it's been refurbished because that seat there, it's all got grease on it and that valve seat, if you put it in and turn it, that has been newly cut or it's original. That's paint, okay? Uh, and that valve, that is all new, that is lovely. So somebody's obviously been um, collecting parts to put it back together. This is a barrel. This is perfect. That has been honed up. It's just waiting for a piston. Um, that is absolutely fine to use. There's no, nothing you can feel on your finger with it. Whether you'd want to rebore them both and go oversize, that's up to you. Um, that obviously goes on there. That, those are your bottom pieces there. These are the covers for the top. So you've got spares of those. And that, and that's your clutch housing. Uh, rear foot pegs, I'm guessing that's a front a different variation of rear axle actually, probably a new rear axle. Um, then a spare seat, a spare fork stanchion, a spare rear hub. Why? Quite why you'd have a spare one of them, I don't know. I must have tripped over it because I bet they're a few quid if you want one. Anyway, as you know, 860 GTS means it's got the electric starter. Now these days, we're all getting older and we all like electric starts. So it looks sporty, it looks the part, but all you do is press the button. Damn sight easier. Ooking great Brembo back brakes both sides. Twin bleeds, so they both move in. And as I say, the discs will recover nicely. Got a spare fork stanchion there. The pair on it's got a little bit of wear up there. Haven't ripped that to see, but I'm guessing they're better. Tanks obviously had some filler at some point, but basically, it's all recoverable. The wheels are uh, Acront proper WM3 format. Um, so, you know, super strong beasts of wheels. They will clean up as easy as anything. Um, exhausts, I'm not sure if they're standard or aftermarket. Could be either. You will know better than me. The reg needs claiming. Um, and it was originally supplied and bottled, <laughs> supplied and bottled by London Motorcycle Centre, um, London's only Italian centre, 57 East Hill SW18. It's a shame it's missing one of those. You can get the parts for these. <clears throat> they are not the cheapest rebuild in the world. You know, parts do cost money, but when they're running, they are absolutely jaw-droppingly awesome. So if you spend the time and money to make this beautiful, you will have a very beautiful, very expensive bike at the end of it. It will be worth your time. Have a look at the pictures and uh, give me a shout. Thank you.